<laughs> Ahoj, přátelé, to jsem já, Pira. Žiju v malém městečku v Česku už sedm měsíce. A mám to tu moc ráda. Um, učím se česky každý den. Víra, tell me some Czech sentences which you learned so far. Um, Půlku chleba prosím. Um, chceš víno nebo pivo? Potřebujeme kávu? Vyhazí slunce? Um, kdo upekl tento goláč? A půjčme plovat? Um, moje oblíbené jídlo uh, je koprová omačka nebo rajská omačka? <laughs> um, moc mi to chutná. <laughs> Modrá je dobrá, už je to tak. Let's test you, Vajra. No? Yeah. Stůl, salát, chleba, maslo, sušenky, kávu, drevo, papír. Ohen, ohen, ohen. Karmín, karmínek, karmínek. Karmínek. Karmín. Dům. Sluncem. Sluncem. Hey, Vira. I have another test for you. Check test? Yeah, check test. So I prepare three sentences for you. So first one is outside is a big garden. Okay. Um Venku je velká zahrada. Oh perfect. Okay, next one. Okay. On the streets are two white cars. Uh, na ulice na ulici a iso byla auta. You forgot the number. Na ulici na ulici iso dvě byla auta. Perfect, perfect. And I have a four dandelions. Mám čtyři Pampelíčky. Do you have? I wish I had any lines. Good job, good job. So my self-study time over the winter lockdown is on average around three hours per day. Thanks to all the motivational support. <laughs> Um, but some days are worse than others. Some days could be one hour and some days could be five hours. It really just depends on how I am on that day. Um, I find that every part of my life is learning the language though. Uh, whether it be going to the supermarket or buying a loaf of bread or trying to use what I've learnt with people who only speak Czech. Um, Sometimes it is a struggle and there are times where I really, really struggle to move forward or I get stuck, um, but I know that these parts are all part of the process of learning a new language and that uh, I just have to overcome that and find ways around it. And if I'm not struggling, then there's something wrong. <laughs> Uh, the introduction to this video took me several weeks to put together and it is all part of my exam and my learning process and learning how to structure these kind of sentences um, and at five months 
I really started struggling with the Czech grammar. I didn't understand any of the content online and I really just needed someone to show me or teach me something that could really like help with structuring sentences. So at six months, I found a Czech teacher on Talkie and I can say that in six and a half months, maybe just at the seventh month mark, I was able to finally just make very short sentences and that has been my greatest achievement so far. So thank you everyone for your support and thank you for all your nice comments on my last video. It really helped to motivate me and keep me going and see you around.